So Ben, day two. Do, do you know what? Of all of our pitches all over the country for these festivals, most of all I enjoy serving the punters at Aintree. They are a pleasure to deal with. They're so chatty. They're so friendly. Uh, they're, they're never in a rush. All of the uh, snobs in the uh, members enclosure at Royal Ascot could really learn a couple of lessons from them. Um, and it's just a nice place to be, it's a nice place to do business. Uh, we had a great meal last night in a village nearby and um, I'm really happy to be here. Yesterday, I can't lie, business wasn't as brisk as it was for the Thursday last year. Weren't the, there weren't the bigger punters about. I just think that you don't get big cash punters who want to bet odds on chances now. And with those sort of two, you know, a couple of three on chances yesterday, they stay away. They're just not interested. The racing has to be competitive for both punter and layer. Um, but today, there's only one odds on chance I hope it'll pick up a bit it's ladies day it's a bit grey I don't think it will rain but um, you know it's uh, it's a great place to be and I'm hoping it'll be busy there's been some bigger bets in the office a couple of 20 grand bets from a big punter hopefully he'll crack on again later so um, I think that Aintree really starts there let's go for it